Hello, it's Craig, Craig from natureshelper.net.au and I'm just going to do a review and some quick tutorials on the new 510 Ego electronic cigarette. Uh, this one's manually operated with a button on it. You press that when you smoke. This one's designed for heavy smokers and generally lasts all day. It has um, a 650 milliamp battery. It actually has a spare one as well, and a spare atomizer and 10 refillable cartridges. Um, it comes in a double decker box. That's the box it comes in. Um, comes in different colours. This is a bronze kit, bronze colour kit. There's the two batteries, two 650 milliamp batteries, you get about 1300 puffs out of each battery and they're the two atomizers and that thing down the bottom there is just a cover for the cover of your between your atomizer and cartridge. They, uh, these are your five cartridges on the top which you get another five on the bottom and you just pull the top layer off, lift it up with a pen and there's more goods under there. There's five cartridges, um, a wall charger, and a US, USB USB plug there. That you can USB charger. You can actually plug the USB charger into the wall plug to charge your e-cigarette, or you can or you can plug your USB plug into your computer or even your car radio on a lot of car radios. That's what your USB plug looks like. That's off my own kit. Um, the wall charger is a European European plug, but it also comes comes with these free free wall adapters that fit Australian plugs. Um, the, to refill, refill your e-cigarette, all you do is just pull your cartridge straight out. This is a new cartridge, this one, so I won't refill it, but I'll show you what you do. Um, you'll see inside the cartridge is material in it. It's um, actually Dacron, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Um, you just put about three to four drops of this e-liquid in and um, tap it down the bottom a bit, give it a bit of a spin and a shake so it's all worked around. Um, and then you just push it back on your e-cigarette, back onto your atomizer. Um, to get the to change the atomizer, all you do is unscrew that little thing, and you can either pull your cartridge off the atomizer. Shit, that's got it. Now, um, unscrew your atomizer that way, left, anti-clockwise to unscrew, and that bit is your battery. And that little bit is your atomizer that screws into it. Now to charge a battery, all you do is you get your USB adapter, USB charger, screw it clockwise into the charger until it's reasonably firm. And then you plug the USB end into your computer or, or your wall charger or clock radio, um, car radio. And when you plug it in, the blue light on the on the battery will flicker on and off to show that it's contacting and there's a little red and green light here on the charger that will um, flicker green and red at first for the first half a minute <coughs> um, when it starts charging the light will go red and when it's fully charged the light will go green it takes about two to three hours to charge a battery. 
but the battery will generally last about eight eight to ten hours of constant use, uh, variable use, I dare say. But they last a lot, ten times longer than your normal e-cigarette. The batteries on these and the cartridges last 400 puffs, um, and they're good sized puffs too. Um, The e-liquid, I also sell that. I sell, this is the non-nicotine liquid. I sell that for the $18 a bottle, for 30ml bottle. That comes in um, four flavours, rum, cherry, menthol and tobacco flavour. I um, also got other kits that I, I sell as well. So, um, stay tuned and... See me next video. Thanks for watching the video.